Good morning dear students and parents. Welcome to LKG Mathematics class. How are you today children? Fine? Yes, I'm sure you all are fine. Enjoying your holidays and doing your work too. So, today I'm here to revise a few topics done in the previous sessions. The first topic is fill in the missing numbers. The first given number is 6. What comes after 6? 7. After 7 you will find a dash and a blank space. You have to fill in the number which comes after the given number. What comes after 7? 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17 and 18. When you see a dash you have to fill in the number which comes after the given number. So after you finish this work. Go through it and find out if there are any mistakes. The next topic is complete the rows. Read the first number. This first number is 0. After 0 you will find 4 dashes. You have to fill in all the numbers which come after 0. What comes after 0 children? 1, 2, 3, 4. The next number given is 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Which number is this children? 6. Very good. Then what comes after 6? 7, 8, 9 and 10. The next number here is 2. What comes after 2? 3, 4, 5 and 6. Which number is this children? Yes. Number 4. What comes after 4? 5, 6, 7, 8. After you do all these lines, you have to go through them and find out if there are any mistakes. The next topic here is circle the correct number. You have to count along with me. So start counting these objects. 1, 2, 3, 4. After you count, find out which is number 4. Is this number 4? No. Is this number 4? No. Is this number 4? Yes. You have to circle it. The next line. Start counting. 1, 2, 3. Is this number 3? Yes. Then you circle it. The next line. Start counting. 1 and 2. Is this number 2? No. Is this number 2? Yes. So you have to circle it. The next topic is decrease counting from 10 to 0. You have to count along with me children. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. You need to write this more than one or two times every day so that you memorize it. The same decrease counting which is also called backward counting are done in other ways also. So it is not necessarily the first given number will be 10. It can be anything. Like this number here is 7. What comes before 7 children? 6. What comes before 6? 5. 4, 3, 2, 1, 0. The next one is, the first number here is 9. Very good. What comes before 9 children? 8. What comes before 8? 7, 6, 5, 4, 3. So if you don't find any dashes after the 3, you don't have to write 2, 1 and 0. You end it by writing number 3. The last topic is dictation. Parents, you need to help your children to do this. You can call out any number from between 0 to 30 and help your children to write on the given line. Like for example, you can call out number 7, 0, 9, 1, 4, 18, 26, 13, 10 and 22. So help them to do this work every day so that they are perfect and thorough with their numbers. Thank you.